Welcome back to another episode of EDC with me. And today we are talking about the Helicon Tex Bushcraft Carry All Backup Bag. Uh, so here is the packaging here. Helicon Tex, I've got quite a few products from them. Uh, I believe it's based out of Poland. Yep. Uh, lots of outdoors, bushcraft type products. Super happy with every every piece of kit I've ever gotten from them. I've been super happy. I don't think you can, I don't think you can go wrong uh, with anything they've got. Uh, if you look at my videos, I've got uh, some of their waste pack uh, videos. I've also got the windbreaker and one of their smaller backpacks. Uh, so yeah, so I recently picked this up. It is a backup carry-all bag. I've been looking at this for nearly a year, thought it was a really interesting idea. Uh, finally, with the holidays, uh, this was actually gifted to me. It was on my list. Uh, and I've now gotten the chance to use it for a few weeks. Super, super impressed on the quality here. Uh, so you can see it's packable. I love packable bags. They make sense to me if you can make it nice and small. Put a bag within a bag, which is exactly the idea here. It's a it's a backup bag. So if you've got a backpack, fanny pack, even cargo shorts, uh, or if you, even if you're just leaving this in your vehicle, the idea is you've got a bag. It's durable. Uh, you can use it for grocery shopping. You can use it to pick up sticks. You could use it to forage. Uh, really, it's just it's literally it's a backup bag. So I'll show it to you. Uh, it, this is it in its packed uh, form. Got some tags here. We've got a bit of nylon, uh, so you could uh, hook it uh, to a bag on the outside if you'd like, so you're not taking up that valuable space uh, or what have you. Uh, the first thing I noticed was the zipper on this. It's kind of hard to tell, but this is a beefy zipper. For, su for such a small bag, I was really surprised on the quality here. And it's got this U shape, which allows you to uh, zip, zip it when it's uh, packed, or when I unpack it here, you can zip it closed. So we've got the, I think it's a nylon type material. I didn't actually look, it feels very much like nylon. Uh, but it is in that rip stop pattern. Not sure if that's showing up on camera or not, but it's got these tiny squares. There we go. So if you were to snag it on something and it rips open, you should be fine. It should just rip off a small section. Basically, it stops the tear, so you just have a little, little hole would be the idea. Okay, so pretty large bag. Uh, I've taken it grocery shopping a few times and I'm able to get a decent amount of groceries. Let's see if I can get this all on camera, probably not. Uh, but what it turns into is, how would I describe this shape? Basically just one massive pouch. Uh, the shoulder strap is adjustable. Nice thick plastics here. Again, uh, some type of nylon uh, material here on the shoulder strap. Reasonably thick, probably inch, inch and a half. Uh, so it's pretty comfortable even when the bag's fully loaded. The uh, zipper I mentioned, um, let's see, it's here on the inside. So here's that really beefy double-sided zipper. You can close this pop. Basically, there's an internal pocket now that you could secure something in if, if you're worried about it falling out. There's an entirely second zippered off section, which actually closes the bag completely. Uh, and you've also got another loop here, so you could connect it to whatever or connect something to it. Uh, this bag is, let's see. See if they've got a liter size on here. It's quite sizable. You could definitely get enough firewood, small bits of firewood. 
here, we'll compare it to an apple. So here's a medium to large size apple. So you can see it's quite large. Volume quite well, nice and lightweight. The heaviest bits are the zipper and strap. The rest of the bag is extremely light. So yeah, I'm not sure that I've seen any videos on this product, but if you're in the market for just a quick kind of carry-all bag that you want to take with you, if you do any kind of thrifting or shopping or just whenever you may just need to have that extra bag uh, when you're out and about, this is a great option. You can swing it over your shoulder. It hugs to the body quite, uh, quite snugly. When it's zipped, I mean, it even, it holds air. I wouldn't say that it's uh, airproof, but it does, or waterproof, but it does look like a reverse zipper is being deployed here, which does aid in water resistance. So yeah, that's kind of just a quick review. I hope that helps anybody who's kind of in the market or maybe you've seen it. I believe it's $20, $25. Well worth the investment. Uh, this is a bag that should last quite a long time, especially with the rip stop. I would even say if it starts to get chewed up, that's probably a bag you could even patch up and continue to use. So yeah, that's my video. And as always, thanks for watching.